Hi, welcome to another set of videos. This time we're visiting North Wales in our little micro camper. Um, unfortunately, the trip didn't go off to a great start. Um, basically, we went up to the local supermarket to get some bits and pieces. Um, I pressed the remote on the car to open the doors, open the boot and put the stuff in and unfortunately the car automatically locks if you don't open the door um, because we'd only opened the boot we'd lock the keys in the car so I had to get my brother to come and get me to go up to the go to my mum's to get the spare key to get to the house to get the car keys to get back again so unfortunately um, it wasn't off to a great start so this video isn't amazingly long but it is only the first day um, so stay tuned um, to see what's coming up To real basically just the coastline and then into Snowdonia again like the other ones two nights in our little micro camper um, on the way up uh, decided to stop at Dingby Castle I think I'm pronouncing that right um, but unfortunately I should have checked um, but uh, it's actually closed on the day we come up which is a Tuesday um, but it's a nice little castle anyway and a little bit of break to where we go um, next anyway so. <laughs> After um, going to the castle, um, we ended up just going around the town in real, um, which, yeah, it's real. What more do you want to say? Yes, it's a nice little place in a sense, but uh, yeah, not that much. And we've just drove down the road uh, about four or five miles to Terran, and I think this is where we're going to be spending the night. Well, couldn't part of the night anyway. Um, yeah, we're right next to the railway station there and then in the background there is the sea so yeah um, this hopefully is that so just having a drink now it's about half past six we just had sandwiches for tea that we brought along because we was running late this morning so but there we go so see you That evening, um, as unfortunately I was um, tired and a bit knackered um, due to my problems, um, basically we just um, sat in the van and just um, watched the sun go down because we got the boot open, you know, facing out to the sea with the sunset in the background and it was absolutely lovely. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to the second part, maybe the first part, I'm not too sure where we are in the video. Basically it's a um, second day of our little trip into North Wales and we're just by um, Tewin, I think it is, um, just on the beach. And basically we got to park just on the beach, I don't know if you can see the camper behind us there, um, but a lovely park up. Got some nice pictures of the sunset, which you'll leave the scene. I'll put some on the screen now, or they'll be in the last video, so click and see that. Um, so, just coming up for the sunset, it's just after four o'clock. I mean, as you can see, the colours in the sky behind are absolutely amazing. So, let's have a walk and see what we can see and if I can get some nice pictures. So, see you in a moment.
let's get you in focus. Right, there we are. Right, again, like I say, I've only just come down from the camper. I'm just over that little ridge there. And uh, just a little bit of a stone thing in here. Going in. I ain't good at describing things, am I? I ain't good at this kind of stuff. But I uh, hope you're liking it anyway. Um, but yeah, I mean, like I say, the, 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 the sun is its not sunrise just yet. Um, but um, the actual... Um, colours in the sky as you can see behind are absolutely um, amazing um, it's pretty peaceful here it's absolutely freezing now I mean according to the weather up it's supposed to be about 8 degrees and feels like about 7 it, it feels me all like about 3 but uh, yeah um, I'm just going to just have a quick walk around because uh, unfortunately I had no sleep because of my back and bits and pieces so uh, but yeah let's, let's um, just carry on and um, see what's around Right, the one nice thing of coming to a beach is once the uh, tide's gone out is the actual uh, patterns uh, that are in the uh, sand where the water's going back or forward and so on. Um, so some of those make actually nice pictures and uh, I'll pop some of those on the screen now and uh, let's see if you like them. Um, so, but the one thing I keep saying, it's cold out here, I tell you that much, but to have Views like that, just straight out of the camper, is absolutely amazing. Um, so that is one good thing with having a little camper, is that you you can just be close to where you need to be and that. So, well, hope you like some of these pictures anyway. I spent about an hour or so um, just having a wander around getting some pictures hope you liked um, what so far um, but unfortunately because it was really cold and uh, I'd had not that much sleep and my back was really playing up um, I just decided to uh, go back to the van and have a drink and uh, get ready for the day ahead Hi, after the little sunrise this morning, unfortunately all my camera batteries decided to die or they're not charged or whatever, I don't know. So I hope you've liked some of the images that I've just actually put up on the screen. You know, it's a few hours later now because we've had a little bit of uh, breakfast and bits and pieces. And now we're on our way to, I think it's Goodwitch Castle. It's the one from the I'm a Sled thing or something. Um, so we're on our way to there now and then um, yeah we'll catch you soon there so hope you've liked it so far right see you in a bit <laughs> <laughs> 